Buenos días. Eh, ¿Hay aquí para el aeropuerto? ¿Autobuses de aeropuerto? Sí, sí. Bueno. Going to Puno. Yeah. Yes. The one good thing here in Peru is that the taxis are cheap. Booking the tickets. 29. Where are you from? Sweden, Switzerland. We're now at the bus station in Arequipa. Uh, just bought tickets to Puno. Uh, yesterday we booked a double room in a hotel. Uh, it was very cheap, it's supposed to be really cold there, so we're, uh, we're preparing for it. And then we're gonna go to the floating islands, it's gonna be sick. We're going with Cruz del Sur, that's pretty posh. And here are our seats, right in the front side. Good morning, it is now 7.50 a.m. and we are waiting for the shuttle bus to the floating islands in Lake Titicaca. Yeah. Yeah, we've been freezing all night, it's like two degrees here and uh, Puno is up at 3,800 meters above sea level, so uh, you can feel it again, feel it in your breath. But this is gonna be cool, super awesome. It's a beautiful day. Gibbity boop up. Can you sit? This is their kind of banana. Doesn't taste much. So this is how they live in these huts. Uh, outside there's a solar panel where they get their get their electricity from to power this beast of a TV. Boom! <laughs> so cute. <laughs> so this island is called Corazón del Lago and each one of these islands has their own president and a few families that live here. Yeah, on this island it's 15 persons. 15 persons live on this island. Like three families or something. Mm. Nice. And this calls the was it the the romance the taxi? Taxi de romantica. Ah. Oh. And this is where they make babies. <laughs> so cool. And it's 98 islands here uh, in Titicaca Lake. 60% is Peru, and 40% is Bolivia.
So we arrived at the second island. Uh, where we're gonna meet our families and have some lunch and then keep going. This is our room here at the on the island and we are about to go have some lunch with the family we're staying with. Traditional mint tea. Delish. Mm. Almost at the top. So I just got, got up to the other side. So that was Apacha Mama. And this is Apacha Tata. And what you do is you pick up a rock and then put it up on the wall. Uh, and you get to make a wish. It's pretty incredible this place. So as you saw, we uh, we were at the floating islands, and the guy who sold us the this trip or this tour said that we were gonna stay and sleep in one of those huts made out of hay or whatever, and uh, and that was adios. Uh, so yeah, that was the thing he said. Yeah, so. You go on a tour, see the islands, and then you're gonna sleep there for, for one night, uh, visit a couple of other islands, and then go back, go back uh, to Puno. And then we'll get here, and this is not what he sold us. Yeah, so what he did was he sold us uh, a completely different trip. Uh, we're staying at a family, and sure, it's, it's all right, but it's it's not what we bought and it's not what we expected uh, so that's why we're staying at this this island tonight so we're pretty disappointed we'll make the best out of it so now I've done one power walk up there one power walk up there and you do feel it since we're pretty high up day six seven in the morning and we are about to leave the island. It's fucking freezing. Uh, we had five blankets this night. It was pretty good. Mm. Uh, so we had breakfast here, some pancakes, and now we're going to the third island, which is the last one on this tour. Good work, boys. <laughs> Yeah. Hola, it's no machine is here. Yeah. Okay, gracias, Jenny. <laughs> Mucho gusto. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Be 
beautiful morning in the island. It's a really, really big lake. And somewhere over there is Bolivia. The last lunch. So we just got back from uh, the trip. Yeah. The the big uh, tourist groups isn't really our thing. No. So we are now leaving Puno. We're going to Arequipa and then to Lima. And we are taking this bus. Uh, so these tickets cost us twenty nine. Solis and the ones from Arequipa to, to Lima cost 85 soles. Uh, these buses are pretty sick, they're very comfy. Uh, Cruz del Sur is something you can depend on, what we've heard. And <clears throat> after we're gonna stay a couple nights in Lima just to check it out, and then we're going to Ecuador. 